what's on your mind. Kaer Morin. Can't imagine this place without Vesemir. I'll head down the valley soon, then find somewhere else to winter next year. Come on, it's the only home we've ever had. Stay. No, Geralt. Place has been dying a while. Last nail in the coffin today. Time we accepted that. I'll remember your teachings always. And the sacrifice you made. Thank you. <laughs> Please. She was my ward, too. And the old should only ever stick around to help the young. You know, this hardly ends your struggle. I know. Whatever you aim to do now, remember you'll find souls willing to aid you in Skellige. Myself, Prach, his children. I don't really know what I'll do next. When doubts plague your mind, follow your instincts. Should they steer you wrong and land you in muck, you'll land at peace with yourself. And that's most important. Good advice. Bah, of course it is. I'm a hero fan, aren't I? I must pick a course for home soon. Take care of yourself, and Siri. Thanks again for everything. So, tell me. I can say I've seen it all now. I still don't believe everything that happened. Risked your lives for me. How can I repay you? We'll think of something, right? Definitely. What will you do? We're bound for Novigrad. To fight the next fight. If you miss us, look for us at the camp. Thanks for everything you did for me and Siri. May I be honest? Had I known what would happen here, I'd never have come anywhere near Kaer Morhen. I'm glad I could help, but I shall leave as soon as Lambert feels better. You going together? I've an idea, but I need a Witcher to help me see it through. Lambert has agreed to assist me. Hmm. <laughs> Good luck, and thanks again. We're even now. Can we talk? What about? Try not to get into any arguments, can you? They've all come here to help. Are you gonna tell me how to behave now? No. Just asking you nicely. Well, how's this for a nice answer? Kiss my ass. Jeez. Holding up all right? Love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is shit, Geralt, and you know it. I knew the old man couldn't live forever. Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death. Whereas he died like a louse. Crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me. You haven't changed a lick. 
That disappointment, I hear? No. Surprise, maybe. Most grow gentler with age. Seems you're growing pricklier. Mom always said I was different. Had some other adjectives in mind, but different will do. Ever play Gwent? Of course. Even tried to teach Vesemir, but turned out he's just mule-headed. Why do you ask? Up for a quick hand? <laughs> Am I? Have you crying like a baby by the time I'm through with you?
You win. Oh, can't believe I gotta give up my unique card. Better your hands than someone else's, I guess. Can we talk? What about? Holding up all right? Love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is shit, Geralt, and you know it. I knew the old man couldn't live forever. Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death. Whereas he died like a louse. Crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me. See you later. Yeah, take care. There you are. Crying shame about Vesemir. I'm sorry. Thanks for your help. I had a debt to pay. Heading straight back to Skellige? Wouldn't be right to tarry. War with the Black Ones won't wait. You can count on me, you know. Always. I know. Thanks. Ah, the courage of a man. Come to see how I'm feeling. Thanks. Not bad. That's good. Ah, son. Horrible about Vesemir. I know you were close. Thanks. We were. Listen, far be it from me to stick my beard, but it'll no scratch an itch. So don't take this the wrong way. I want to help, whatever you decide, but to my mind, we've got to counterattack. We've got to find the hunt, Eredin, and charge at them both like a bull at a heifer. Not that simple, unfortunately. We have no way of finding them. They find us easily. Can take us by surprise whenever they want. Forgive me, Geralt, but that's the blathering of a man who clearly can't snap out of it after a tragic loss. Drink it off. Sleep it off, whatever it takes. Just get yourself together and think things through. I'll do that, Sultan. Of a man. I'm sorry for your loss, Geralt. Zirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Ciri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses, arch mistresses of magic. You mean the lodge? Many of the lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Fringilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. 
Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best. Don't trust the Lodge one bit, but doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think! I've had enough of this! I won't be taken somewhere like a... bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly, and not through Geralt. I'm gone. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet, either. Geralt, please, not now. <sighs> By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalar says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? The Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! You'll regret that. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Wimp. We'll see about that. <laughs> Come and get me.
Good shot. Nice. Come on. 
<laughs> You'll regret that. service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Don't know. Enlighten me. Imlarith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilach. He told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come. We shall talk on the way. Wait. Something I gotta tell you before we go. You know, the Emperor really wanted you found. Yennefer mentioned something. Wanted you to visit him. Why would you tell me now? Because this could be your last chance to see your... father. You think I should go? to decide for yourself. But I want your opinion. Should I go or not? Probably just wants to talk. How can you be sure? What if he wants something more? Promised me he wouldn't force you to do anything. So I should go? He is your father. Vizima is on the way. I suppose we can drop in. Ready? Let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. Your Imperial Majesty, Geralt of Rivia, and... Cyrilla Fiona Ellen Rhiannon, Queen of Sintra, Princess of Bruges, and Duchess of Sutton. 
heiress to Innes Ard Skellig and Innes Ann Skellig, and suzerain of Atra and Abiara. Get used to it. Before long, every soul from Nilfgaard to the Dragon Mountains will kneel before you. I did not expect you to keep your word, Witcher. Siri wanted to hear what you have to say. And she will. Your reward. Didn't come to collect on a deal. You asked me to bring your daughter here. I did just that. Siri will hear you out. Then we leave. Are you sure? Never again would you need to stalk monsters while wading through sewage. I'm sure. I understand. Honor prevents you from accepting coin. In that case, a stallion, a thoroughbred Nilfgaardian, awaits you in the stables. Treat it as an expression of my gratitude. Thank you. Now forgive me. I wish to speak to my daughter. Follow me, sir. White Wolf, good to see you. Greetings, General. You had no trouble crossing the Ponta, I trust. None. I take it you crossed via the ford near Banglin? It's fortunate you did not choose to ride through Rhind. A troubled region still. Radovid seeks to breach the front in the west. But he'll not succeed. Not before the princess becomes empress and we bring order to the area. Siri hasn't agreed to that yet. Yes, of course, she's tactful, not one to celebrate an offer not yet made. But this is not the kind of offer one refuses. Isn't it? Do you know any who would not like to be Emperor of Nilfgaard? Can you imagine? I thought only the wine-addled minds of bards and poets could give birth to such stories. The prodigal daughter of the most powerful ruler in the continent's history returns on the eve of his final triumph to embrace her inheritance. <laughs> Simpletons adore such stories as they do the princesses, ever beautiful and delicate or other. Geralt, we're leaving. So nice to see you, my lady. Likewise. Time we were on our way. A shame you can't stay. I hope to continue this on another occasion. Well, that makes one of us. Well? If he thinks he can buy me, he is sorely mistaken. He offer anything specific? Yes, very specific. Thoroughly absurd. Sorry, I don't want to talk about it. Not now, at least. Won't pressure you. When you're ready, let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri, who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die.
The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the ladies of the wood. The peasants feared coming here. And the Baron thought the Ladies of the Wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. He found his wife, took her away somewhere far. Anna, she was unwell. A true shame. We stand to find Imlarith here? You sure? Avalok told me of beings who commune with the NL Elves. They can be found in every part of our world. In Velen, the crones do this. Apparently, Imlarith came here at Eridin's behest, to order the crones to keep their eyes open and ears pricked, in case Avalok were to seek shelter in his Velen hideout. Took the order literally judging by all the ears hanging in the woods. Think Imlarith might still be here? He craves the pleasures of the flesh, wine, sex. The crones indulge him, flatter his ego. I'm certain he'd not let this opportunity pass, and we'll be on Bull Mountain for the Sabbath. You actually know this area? Centuries ago, it was a hallowed site for druids. But then the crones arrived, destroyed the Velen Circle, and deformed the Sacred Oak atop the mountain. An important feast is observed here annually. The Sabbath, they call it. All the local folk attend. I suspect Imlareth attends too as the crone's guest. Seem to know it well. Havelock's a good tutor. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. The peasant folk of Velen call this night the Feast of Gifts. I've no idea Loads why. Loads of footprints. A crowd of peasants came through here. Geralt? 